All right, so what's going on, everybody? Today, we're going to be learning this new cheese move that I figured out just a little while ago. So let me go ahead and hit y'all with these normal zigzags, right? This is normally how zigzag looks, right? When you go to the park or stage, you see people doing this nonsense. And then sometimes they like to make it short and do stuff like this. And just, you know, keep it real short. And then they just keep doing this and that and that and that. Or then sometimes people like to, to hide around screens and do this, this type of nonsense. And just keep going to the left and right. Then they stop it and go that way. And then they run in circles. And then they stop and then go back to this. And then you got your people that like to do this right here. And then they like to break out of it and do stuff like that. And then you got your people right here that love, that love this move. Look at this. They love that move. They love that move, don't they? Look at that. And then they finish up strong at the basket. Some people are trash though and they can't finish up at all. And then you have people that like to do this right here. Let's go ahead and get it going. Look at that nonsense. You got people that do that. It's just crazy, right? So today, I'm gonna show you a cheese to counter their cheese to make them upset just like they're trying to make you upset. And basically, what you have to do is get right here, post up. Now, normally you would go this way, right? If you're trying to just aggravate somebody, all right? But no, what you wanna do is hit your trigger, your turbo trigger, and you wanna go to the left. That way he'll spin out of that and then check it out. Look at this. He's always ready to go the other way every single time. And when you learn how to do it right, and see, then you can go in there and actually when you start doing enough out here, you can do it enough times out here. And you can either finish up with a tray ball or you can just, you know, just keep aggravating your opponent. All right. So when they try to hit you with that nonsense, you just do this right here to them. And 2K's defense is known for being bad, you know. So you're going to slide all across the place. Your person is going to start uh, spinning in circles and just slipping everywhere and he just isn't going to do what you want him to do. It's, it's not really any foot planning going on. So he's just doing what he wants when he wants and not giving you any control. A lot of people like to say, well, it's just because you don't know how to play defense. It's not that. You just cannot control. You can have the best defender in the game, and you're still going to slide all over the place because of these animations. But check this out. All you got to do is just keep doing that. And see, then when you can sell it like that, after you do it on the outside enough times, they'll stop running and chasing you. And then you can get right up in there. Just like that. And just run straight up and finish strong. Now there's many ways you can do this. Alright, so check this out. You can do it like this. Like that. Or you can go out here, stay behind the three-point line, and be a three-point cheeser. Whichever one you feel like doing. Check this out. And you can just keep it going. And just keep it going. Just like that. And they'll just keep sliding. And then you want to post yourself up one time. Get right in the middle. And let it fly. Tray ball. Easy. Alright. Now you might get a shot penalty for it because, again, it's like zigzag. So what you want to do is make sure you do it enough times. And just let it fly. Sometimes your person will not make it because you can either get green lights or you could get early releases. Most of the time you're going to get early and late releases, but even though you know you didn't release early or late, it's just something with the game mechanics. But check this out. You don't even got to get posted up. There you go. Green light. Simple as that. I want you guys to try that out. Come back and let me know. And this is just a little cheese tutorial and I can give y'all more but that'll be later on in the future like the video if you like the video and again you have to cheese the cheesers if you don't you're not going to be able to ride with anybody on 2k15 i'm out of here peace